Whenever dealing with waterfront property, regardless of whether it's in Prince Edward Island or anywhere on planet Earth, the question always arises is what is the erosion rate of the shore like? So the Prince Edward Island government has created this tool, which will supply you with actual factual data based on past performance that will show you a map of what the erosion is like. So you're just going to fill the basic information out here. You're going to click on the next page. We're looking for one property. We've entered our PID number here. This is located in Park Corner. Next, they ask you to find your watershed. So we're going to click on this link here, and it's going to bring up what I believe is called the chip computer. Now on chip, we go to the top left. We enter the same number again, 842195. It brings up a list of one property. It would be more if it was a subdivision, as I've discussed in the past. And this is the property here we're looking for. So we're just going to copy that WS underscore 195. And then we're going to go back to our previous window. In this box here, we're just going to right click and we are going to paste the WS175 in there. We don't have any future or any further comments or information. We accept this. We answer the highly skillful and challenging math question here. Hit preview. Basically just confirms everything we have entered. We will submit this sucker and then wait for the response. The response typically comes sometimes in one, two days. They're usually very, very good. This report took a whole 19 minutes to be turned around by Catherine at the provincial government. Thank you, Catherine. So you were going to receive two documents. You're going to receive this document here, which is a one-page map, which is similar to what we saw on the chip computer. And it basically shows you the subject property, which is here. And it tells you what the erosion rate is like graphically. The second PDF file is a little more detailed, but it's only five pages. It tells us the PID number we typed in and the location of the property, as well as a link for even more information. So five pages here, which covers basic information about erosion on the island. This particular case, it was rumored that this property was a high erosion rate. It's actually low. So it's a great idea to have actual factual data when you're looking at a property in PEI. My biggest concern would be if there is a house, how close is the house to the shore? If it's been built properly, it should have had this type of data in front of it when you're building so you'd know how far back you need to build and longevity of the lot. That's it for today. If this information was helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and be sure to press the little bell symbol beside the subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And if you have any questions at all about PEI real estate or Prince Edward Island in general, put them in the comments below.